you can see this. These are the performance of the website. Here you can see total web search clicks one. This was this was on 30th August, Wednesday. This was on 10th, zero clicks. September 11th, it is two clicks. We have September 20th, total web search clicks one. Here you can see this indexing 22 not indexed pages, seven indexed pages. That means the website which I have used have only seven indexed pages. If you want to check the full report, you can click this full report. Now see, we have 22 not indexed pages and seven index. We can also see four reasons they are telling. Now page with redirect, not found, discovered, crawled. Now these are some of the reasons which the pages have not been indexed. That is fine since it was a website which was created just for practice. Now when you scroll down, you can see the experience. Mobile usability, page experience, core web vitals. Since there are less traffic, there are no much data over here. Now when it comes to mobile usability, the experience is good. Now we can check the performance of the particular site, total clicks, total impressions, average CTR, average position. All these things can be checked once you have a decent website traffic on your particular website. We can see different pages. As you all know, we can see video pages if we have a video. Now we don't have much videos in that. Now the next one which we can see is sitemaps. Click on sitemaps and see there is an XML sitemap which was done by robot as you all know. XML is done by bots. HTML is for humans. It is a success. Now in order to delete one of these properties, see this. This is from GoDaddy. This is from Wix. This is from WordPress. Now out of these three things, if you want to delete anything, you should click this. Now let me delete the website from Wix, click this, scroll down and go to settings. In the settings, click on remove property. Click on remove property, then you have to check for the confirmation, remove property and it's done. The Wix website has been removed from Google search console. Now we have only two websites which was from GoDaddy and WordPress. Thank you. We'll see you in the upcoming sessions.